Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And on the menu today, live action from the Pro League coming up. What might we see today, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. And so the match is underway. Moving into the advanced position. Crossing possibilities. sound goalkeeping well that's such a good save isn't it how did he keep that one out and over it comes and clears the danger well, he just let his opponent glide by Plays it back. Could be. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. again with the score line standing at 1-0 Santos Enrique delightful pass well not quite the header he had in mind and the goalkeeper gobbling that one up Romarinho. Andre, Andre. Well, they keep passing away. Running with the ball confidently. And good pressure high up the pitch. Something to worry about here. Cuts it back. Off the post and back in play. And a goal, it was served up on a silver platter for him.
Well, as you can see, he's first to react, he's first to the ball, and he deserves his goal. That's an excellent finish. Well, a second goal for them here. Well timed tackle. Ahmed Egazi. Well, the visitors have controlled possession, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Able to get a body in the way. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Now he must favour the cross. And reading it absolutely superbly. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. All hands on deck. Superb block. Good looking ball. Oh, moving it nicely. And they could face difficulties here. Well, it might still work out for them. And they'll get ready for the throw in. This looks interesting. Quarting him. And a goal! Well, here it is again. First to the ball, clever header and a good finish. He's done really well there. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Splendid tackle, and a throw in coming up. Now, what can they produce on the flank? Cross could be useful, it comes to absolutely nothing. Al Shamrani. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Romarinho and Hamdala. An effective challenge. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. He's really dominating in attack in this game, Stuart. Well, he's looked sharp, hasn't he? Yes, he scored a good goal, but his general play has been excellent. I've enjoyed watching him today. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Fuzair. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, straight into the meat of the penalty area. Oh, it's gone in, would you believe? And that is going to be classified as an own goal. Well, as the replay shows us, that will be classed as an own goal. He's a bit unlucky there.
So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Albishi, Andre Andre, Abderazak Hamdala. Oh, great play. You can sense the threat is there. Ahmed Egazi. Decent position. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Well, they've decided to make a change. Going short. Has someone to play it to. And a body in the way. And a short corner, let's see. Cutting the ball back. Now the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there. He's gone for goal. Oh, brilliant technique. I'm not sure about you, Stuart, but I thought that was going in. Well, so did I. But in the end, it comes to nothing. But what a great strike it was. It was hit so sweetly. Atsu. Oh, showing excellent vision. This looks promising. Able to get a body in the way. Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. So the corner played into the box, able to deal with the threat. Abderazak Hamdala, Albishi, Hamdala. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. And offside, well, close one. to the final 20 minutes oh lovely ball oh crucial tackle brilliant So the final whistle almost upon us, and this is not exactly what the home fans had in mind when they arrived at the ground today, Stuart. Well, they've had no defensive game plan today. The forwards haven't pressed the ball, the midfield players have been outnumbered, and there is too much space between the defenders at the back. That's been the problem. And collected tidily, he had plenty to think about. Oh, 
A fine reading of the situation. Atsu. Here's Eder. Options in the centre. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. Andre, Andre. Hamdala. Not high quality defending. We will have three minutes of additional time at the end here. Oh, he looks threatening. Can he finish? Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Can someone get on the end of this? And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he should be happy with his goal and the win but he'd be slightly annoyed that he hasn't scored a couple more. Overall, though, I thought he was excellent.